Okay, so I'm going to be having a look at my animation and giving some critical analysis of what I've done and what I could do better. So let's have a look at the animation itself. So the car drives in, stops, you have the camera that pans around, showing off the car, then you have the particle generation which was part of my research. Um, so in all, all it's 18 seconds so if we go have a look here are some things that I thought I could do better. Now when doing the play blasts obviously lighting isn't considered and I do believe that this first shot is a, maybe a bit too dark because the lights are set up in one particular way as you can see the car there it looks good that the car is getting light on it and you can see the streaks of light on this shot go through. I do believe the actual animation of it, that that turn there looks a little bit unnatural and it's something that I'd go back and tweak if I had more time. You can also see artifacts um, maybe due to the codec, maybe due to the pictures it's really not showing the nice lighting that it should do. This is a good camera angle. I quite like it, the fact that it zooms out. It's got like that wide angle look. I do think this cut is maybe a little bit awkward. I do like the slider shot. That is using keyframes. Now, when I was doing the research I was having a lot of issues with the particle generation. The particle generation, if you watch it, comes out in like these bursts, which is what not what I was going for, I was going for a continuous. However, through researching and tweaking and lack of time I couldn't find the settings to get rid of that. So here's where the artifacting comes up most, you can see the different shades of white. Um, this was a thing that I did in After Effects just to give the animation a little bit more life, again using the basics of keyframing. I keyframed a glowing more lit layer over the, over the top of this and then you see there is the glow and there's the ending shot. Um, overall I think my actual animation could have been better like here you can see the wheels turning um, but for the realistic vibe and like showcasing the car is what I was going for I do believe I have a achieved my objective and albeit the particle system was not 100% what I want it's pretty close to what I was looking for anyway and I enjoyed making this project and it's been great fun.